Hey, what's up? My name is Alejandro Debrat. I'm a professor here in the biology department at SMU. You're joining me from one of our lab classrooms where we have laboratory courses such as biochemistry lab, immunology lab, and gene editing lab. So if you're a student that's looking into getting into a career in the life sciences and medicine, dentistry, then SMU is a place for you. Here in the biology department, we take pride in offering courses that are in-depth and uncompromising classroom experiences where you're not only learning the material in an engaging way, but you're actually getting to apply that knowledge we teach you to think critically, to use that information to solve everyday problems. In courses like human physiology, you'll be using the information you're learning in the classroom to solve case studies from the scientific literature and the medical field. We also offer cutting edge, hands-on laboratory courses in which students are exposed to some of the most advanced technology in the biomedical sciences. Students can take lab courses such as biochemistry lab, immunology lab, microbiology lab. One of our newest laboratory courses is gene editing. And in this lab, students are taught how to design and to carry out gene editing experiments in which they use the CRISPR-Cas9 technology it has revolutionized genetics and biomedical sciences in the last six years. In this course, students are being assigned a gene in the fruit fly genome, a model organism in the sciences, and they are deleting that gene and replacing it with a visible marker. And so here you're looking at two vials. One of them contains normal flies and the other one contains gene edited fruit flies done by last year's students. And the difference between the two is that the gene edited fruit flies contain a red fluorescent protein that's being expressed in their eyes. And so students were able to actually generate this and are working on publishing this in a peer reviewed scientific journal. And students are also able to join our laboratories here at SMU that are led by faculty and get, and get unique exposure to the scientific process and potentially get their work published in peer-reviewed journals. So we hope you join us here at the biology department at SMU where we really think you are going to be getting some of the greatest education in the biological sciences.